Now, one of the things with ginger is, you know, if you're making things like, I don't know, like a, a Thai curry paste or you're using it in a curry, it's a great flavour ginger, but sometimes, yeah, it's a bit stringy, isn't it? It's that same kind of thing like we're talking about with the tomato skin. If you've got a piece of ginger in your curry, it's not pleasant eating, is it? You know, it's a bit, it's a bit fibrous. It's a little bit like you're eating, I don't know, a bit of matting, a bit of carpet. So there's a way you can get all of the beautiful flavour of the ginger without having to have all of the bits in there. Any bright ideas? What do we do? You've watched it over the weekend. Keep quiet. What? I'm not going to grate it. No, I'm not going to grate it. No. Any other ideas? What? <laughs> Oh, you're doing someone else over there. That's nice, isn't it? So you stand there, kind of watching me, just go, yeah, that, that looks really nice over there. The Jamie Oliver <laughs> stuff looks fantastic. Now, what we do is, it's a very, very simple process. Now, the thing with it is, you've got to make sure it's a nice, fresh bit of ginger that you get, because there's a load, load of moisture in the ginger, and that's what we're looking for. We want all of the beautiful juice to come out of the ginger. So, quite simply, all you do is you get your little piece of ginger, cut it up into little bits, and if you think, if you're going to use this, you can see already with this, look at all the fibres in there. When you're eating that, that's going to stick in your teeth, no matter what you do with that. That's not going to be the best thing in the world. So all you do is you get yourself a J-cloth, a, um, a bit of a, a dish cloth. You've got to be clean, obviously, not all you've used for your pots. Put your ginger in the middle, twist that around, squeal, twist that around, and then, as you keep twisting, the ginger, <laughs> this is really dry ginger, the ginger <laughs> juice squeeze out. Look, it isn't working. That's rubbish, isn't it? <laughs> Believe me, it does do it normally. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't happen to Gord when he did that. Thanks, thanks for that, Eleanor. Believe me, it works. What happens under these lights is dried out. So what you want is you want to squeeze it. And as you squeeze it, all the ginger juice comes out. So what happens is you have none of those little bits of fibre, but you have all of the beautiful flavour.